Hello, hello, and welcome to Life with the Irwins. I'm Elizabeth, and today I'm going to be showing you a little sneak peek at my daily routine. Uh, today was Monday when I was doing laundry. Laundry day is always Monday for me. And although I had finished folding and putting away my laundry in the video, the video never got recorded by my camera, so I wasn't able to get that done. But hopefully this will help ease your OCD in you that I was able to film the completed work from start to finish. So I hope this helps. <laughs> And luckily for me, today wasn't that much of uh, dishes to do. It was mostly just recyclables. So all I was doing was just rinsing them off and cleaning my sink. And uh, the rest of the dishes I had already washed or put them in the dishwasher to wash. So I do both dishwasher and I hand wash. So which I like to do with some of my items, like my pots and pans. I don't like them getting ruined by the soap in my dishwasher. So I hand wash them. So here I'm just uh, cleaning off dishes, put, put away the, um, the recycle and then I just wanted to show you really quick that um, if you ever buy these, save them. The Starbucks Frappuccinos, my favorite flavor is the coffee flavor, but if you ever have these, sorry it's Caleb. <laughs> He's making some noises. Yeah. What are you doing, mister? Are you laying down on the floor? What are you doing? You guys making messes of shoes everywhere? Mm-hmm. Throwing shoes. Why do you have to wash your hands? I can wash my hands. Why? Because. Because. Can we wash your hands? Because you have to wash your hands? Yeah. Hmm. Hey, soap, mommy. Soap. With soap? Yeah. Oh. That's a good. Soap, mommy. All right. Soap. We'll wash your hands. Okay. With soap, mommy. Hold on. Let's see all the mess they like to make. They got into my purse. All done? done. You wash your hands? <gasps> Yay! All clean. Let's go see Caleb. There's Mr. Mister. There he is. Life with toddlers and babies. What, oh, sweetie? I know. Yeah. And he's getting into my recycle bag. What's Caleb doing? What are you doing, Caleb? Caleb, you're making a mess! What are you doing? Really? What are you doing, mister? So anyway, as I was saying that, um, if, you, if you have, if you drink these, save them because these will make perfect um, a gifts or craft ideas. What I do, I just, I just take all this stuff off. You can see focus. So if, um, so anyway, I take this part off, which is just plastic. And then um, this is just taped on. I don't know if you can see that, but anyway, it's just taped on, and 
in this part too so you just take it off um, I like to use um, lemon oil just to take the residue of this this tape or sticker off and it works really well um, and then so I was thinking of doing that for for Christmas gift or something maybe um, I don't know I'll, I'll think of something maybe put at little drinks in there with a little cute straw sticking out like these don't have the tops on I must have recycled them but um, these would look cute with straws in them and then um, or you could put like um, um, hot cocoa mix or cookie mix in there and then um, put some kind of like um, some of that spray fabric on there and put some fabric little Christmas fabric or ribbon on it it looks so cute so anyway if you have these save them so they make great crafts great gifts ideas you know so that's that so here I am in my living room um, an idea that I actually have um, I don't know if you remember but I had mums here um, behind this harvest sign this part of the living room um, my husband took it out and he planted them in our front yard so um, they'll look cute um, next year this harvest sign just won't stay up so I'm thinking maybe just putting some kind of like hot glue or something here on this end because that's where that's where it tilts it tilts it forward so I need something in underneath here something that will hold the sign up so because it kind of looks silly just being laying down and anyway back to what I was saying um so I had purchased these at Walmart um, they're tablecloths and um, anyway I originally wanted to do you know to put this in my table and then I decided what if I make pillows instead um, for my living room they would look so cute with buttons on them and then um, they would look so cute on pill as a pillow right I mean the quality is phenomenal it's really nice fabric and um, I, I can feel that it will be easy you can easily wash these and then iron them out and I mean they're, they're perfect for I mean they're tablecloths so they're to withstand um, maybe some spills or something um, um, to be used and so I thought they would be great for pillows and then I decided what if I buy a couple more and make them into um, couch covers instead so that's where I'm at right now I just have the pile in my living room, baby's crying. Uh, I'm gonna have to go in a bit, but um, so yeah, that's gonna be my project this week is to make um, covers, couch covers for my couches. Sorry, it's such a mess. Um, so yeah, so they'll make perfect couch covers. So that's gonna be my project for this week. Um, so I'll be doing some sewing and. Hopefully I can record that for you. Um, so yeah, wish me luck and um, I'll talk to you later.
hope you enjoyed this video today and um, yeah I'm pretty happy how this turned out with the cushion covers it's not perfect but it brightens up my room this living room so much and I'm really happy how it turned out um, the sun hits it it's perfect um, and the nice thing about it is that it, it's tablecloth so it's easy to clean um, any stains that are on there there has already been stains on it and I was able to remove them um, of course I have six kids so I mean stains was about to happen anyway um, and um, I am actually going to be doing more tutorials um, and more videos so keep posted keep yourself posted up on my channel hit the notification button so you get a little um, to get notified that we posted a new video and um, I will be doing some maybe uh, um, little cookie gifts with those little jars that I was um, that I showed a little bit earlier in this video and um, and then see show you how I dress it up and make it look pretty and giftable and give you ideas so you can do something similar to that or you know I don't know make your own soap or anything you know whatever you want to make so I'm just here for ideas I've got so many and um, I just want to be able to share that with you I had a great time thank you so much for joining me today and I'll see you next Tuesday bye